Hey, good morning. Uh, Dale Cowan, Senior Agronomist with the Agris and Wanstead Co-ops. I'm uh, joined this morning by Lance Rupert, uh, Agronomy and Technology Lead for uh, Growmark out of Bloomington. He's here at our My Field Days to share some of the latest uh, technology developments and what Growmark is, is up to and uh, maybe uh, just expand a little bit on what you're going to talk about this morning. Uh, we're going to talk a little bit, give some examples of some aerial imagery work that we've been doing, some drone work. Uh, one of the interesting ones we're working with is an autonomous drone, so it flies itself and lands itself and then transfers data in a 4x4 four four box out in the field. Uh, and then sensors out in the field specifically uh, working with specialty crops on disease modeling and uh, growing uh, growth development modeling. Okay. Now I believe you were doing some work with the Telenair as well. Uh, and can you expand a little bit on how that is, uh, what kind of is the structure behind that? Uh, 8 to 12 flights per year, uh, per season, uh, imagery with data analytics behind it. That's the key that we like is uh, they take the imagery and then they're running analytics behind it to help our crop specialists like yours understand what's going on in the field to help them be more efficient and get to the right spots at the right time. Okay, so uh, Growmark's pretty heavily invested in some uh, venture capitalists. Can you talk a little bit about uh, some of the ad investment and just to what extent it's being invested and what some of the uh, I guess the projection goals might be of some of this technology? Sure, so we're an limited partner with the Cultivian Sandbox, a venture capital firm in Chicago. Uh, we've, uh, I guess, pledged $10 million in a $150 million fund. So they're looking for startup type companies, things that are up and coming to invest in, hopefully get a good uh, almost 10x return is what they shoot for on those investments. So it's a, it's a long term investment play, but it also gives us good access to information of what's coming. So we, we have an idea of what might be disrupting our, our space, Agris's space, and then bring those those uh, those new technologies to Agris and Agris's customers. Good. Well, we're always, as an agronomist, I'm always looking for those analytical services that are descriptive and predictive and, and prescriptive that kind of make our life a little a little bit easier. So I, I think just back to Intellin our bit, that's kind of what they're, what they're kind of featuring is they send alerts when there's something worth seeing of note. Correct. Yeah. Yeah, and that, that's really helpful. I mean, to me, uh, technology's got to help our our growers and our people, our crop specialists, your people, be more efficient with their time uh, instead of just kind of aimlessly looking for issues. Hopefully, the remote sensing imagery can help tell us where to go, uh, even in the back corner of that field that we don't normally we maybe don't normally walk make, to. Make, get back <laughs> so that far. Make, sometimes. make us better at what we do for yeah, the grower. Good. Yes. Well, the best part about the uh, the investments that you're making, the 10 million, being part of the co-op system and being a member of Growmark, we're we're going to reap the benefits of that as well as just being a member. And certainly, our our farm members here and owners are going to uh, be part of that as as it unfolds. Absolutely, so, that's great. So, thanks, Lance, for joining us, and Thank we you. look forward to your presentation this morning. Thank you.